Hey, y'all. Welcome to the Blue Plate Special! I have music right here in downtown Knoxville. Coming up in the second half of the show, we've got Tom Utes and Eric Brace. But right now, here's Daryl Wallace. Take a little trip and try to get you off of my mind I didn't bother to tell him I didn't have a penny left to my name How you and him had seen to that They left me here just numb in pain How did we go from my due Down to saying we're through honeymoon honey to if I never see you again it'll be too soon yeah once you slam that door shows me love's not welcome here anymore how did we go from I do to seeing we're through My guitar in the back seat slid behind the wheel to drive. Not really sure where I'm going. I'm just glad I made it out alive. And I hope you're happy in your new life. When your friends get together and you talk, just tell them all what a sorry SOB that I am. How everything was always my fault How did we go from my due Down to seeing we're through How did we go from the honeymoon, honey To if I never see you again It'll be too soon, yeah, once you slam that door Shows me love's not welcome here anymore How did we go from I do Saying we're through How did we go from I do Saying we're through Thank you all so much Great to be back here at the Blue Plate Special Thank y'all. Uh, this next song is uh, about growing up here in East Tennessee. I was very fortunate to be able to do that back in a time where you could run the lakes and the mountains and the back roads and not get yourself in too much trouble. And I know that everybody has that special place that they call home. And I hope this one takes you back to yours. Home ain't always where I lay my head Home ain't always where I sleep in my bed A thousand miles away, a small town down the road No matter where I find myself, there's no place like home And home's where Papa taught me how to fish is where I stole my first kiss Home is where I learned to drive and wreck my first car Home is where I learned to play guitar Home is where I learned to walk before I learned to run Home is lazy summer days laughing in the sun Home is chasing lightning bugs mesmerized by their glow no matter where I find myself, there's no place like home. Home is where I found my amazing wife. Home 
is where we live a wonderful life. Home is where you'll find us hand in hand as we grow old. Home is where they'll spread our ashes one day when we're gone. Home is where I learned to walk before I learned to run. Home is lazy summer days just laughing in the sun. Home is chasing lightning bugs mesmerized by their glow. No matter where I find myself, there's still no place like home. No matter where I find myself, there's still no place like home. That's Daryl Wallace on the WDVX Blue Plate Special. Well, welcome back to the show, Daryl. We, um, we've, we've talked to each other a handful of times here on Saturdays. Yes, we have. And, uh, so, so we've chatted about a lot of things uh, in various shows, but for those of you who are new to seeing Daryl, I'll, I'll mention that he's very active in songwriter circles, um, and he's part of a... a small record label that started recently yeah. for songwriters called Foggy Hill Records. Yeah. Um, but, you know, I was asking him before the show kind of what's new, and those um, songwriter circles have taken him um, across the ocean in um, recent times. So tell us a little bit about how you ended up um, over in the Netherlands and what that was all about. Well, um, I was um, one of the songs off this current album, It Is What It Is, um, was nominated for a uh, Josie Award, which is an independent musician award. And that was last year. And I got to walk the red carpet at the Grand Ole Opry with my amazing wife, which is, was kind of surreal to, uh, to see all these uh, fine musicians and artists. And um, that got picked up in Europe. And it, um, it got me a nomination at the Fair Play Country Music Awards over there their red carpet show and they um they invited me to come and play so i was able to do that last august and i actually won an award which is kind of yes it was it was amazing it was just a wonderful time over there in europe well great and uh, along the way last year was a big year for you also wrote a song that um hit number one on the independent music charts right so yes i uh i was a co-writer on that one with uh, georgia boozer craig Hendricks, joe laduca and Corey Lee barker out of nashville and uh, we were very fortunate with that song it was uh we actually wrote it at the josie awards and it was picked up in january recorded in march and it hit number one in uh in july of last year so 23 was a great year, and I'm looking uh, forward to more from 24. Yeah, hopefully hopefully another good one for you. All right, well, let's get some more music. And this is, uh, this is a song that actually, uh, off the album, that got me nominated. forward three steps back didn't seem to be another way cause no matter what the situation things never worked out for me I just came to accept it it's just the way life can be and I've never done anything easy the hard way has been my way till now I've never done anything that's easy and Darling, till you showed me how Maybe it's the way that you listen And maybe it's your sense and guile Sometimes know just what I'm thinking When you give me a wink and a smile Maybe it's the way you hold me And 
tell me I'm the one for you And when I'm down you console me You know exactly what to do And I've never done anything easy The hard way has been my way till now I've never done anything that's easy and Darling, till you showed me how Maybe in this time of reflection And maybe it's my turn to see That life is truly what you make it And I'm glad you made your life here with me and I've never done anything easy The hard way has been my way till now I've never done anything showed me how not till you showed me how not till you showed me how I moved to uh, Nashville back in 1990. Did some singer-songwriter stuff over there for a lot of years. And I still do. I still play in Nashville a couple times a month. This is one of those songs that came out of that time. Maybe you thought that a change would do you some good. Maybe you thought that I would let go forever. Maybe you thought that I would, when if only I could. Maybe, baby, I. Maybe, baby, it's all just a waste of time Maybe, baby, I'm still crazy about you Maybe, baby, you're always on my mind Maybe I thought I could somehow just win you over Maybe I thought I could somehow just change your mind. Maybe the thought of your arms being wrapped around another. It's maybe too much for this man at the end of his line. It's maybe, baby, I. Baby, baby, you're always on my mind Maybe I need some time myself Maybe I should just move on Maybe I'm having a real hard time Ever since you've been gone Maybe, baby, I Maybe, baby, you're 
you're always on my mind Thank you all for coming out today and uh, sharing a little piece of your weekend with us here at WDVX. We really do appreciate it. This next song is the title track off my album. It is what it is. Not that anybody's ever heard that phrase before. I wrote this song about five years ago before the world went crazy, and we all know how that's been going. And you may hear a phrase or two in this that some other folks have been using lately. But now you'll know where it all came from. Well, it is. What it is and it ain't what it ain't you can do what you can do and you can't what you can't yeah the truth may be the truth you know at least until it ain't it's always the same old same old because underneath that big black cloud there's always a silver lining if at first you don't succeed i suggest you just keep trying because we're all in this together so suck it up with your whining It's always the same old, same old Because it is what it is And it ain't what it ain't You can do what you can do And you can't what you can't Yeah, the truth may be the truth You know, at least until it ain't It's always the same old, same old Yes, no good deed goes unpunished, you know that's the price you pay. If you're not jumping on the bandwagon, well, you must be in the way. More things seem to change, you know, more they stay the same. It's always the same old, same old, because it is what it is, and it ain't what it ain't. You can do what you can do, and you can't. What you can't Yeah, the truth may be the truth You know, at least until it ain't It's always the same old, same old Sing it with me Because it is what it is And it ain't what it ain't You can do what you can do And you can't what you can't Yeah, the truth may be the truth You know, at least until it ain't It's always the same old, same old Because it is what it is and it ain't what it ain't You can do what you can do and you can't what you can't Yeah, the truth may be the truth, you know, at least until it ain't It's always the same old, same old I said it's always the same old, same old You know it's always the same old, same old Thank you all so much. This uh, next song was um, the one that uh, went number one for us back in July. My first number one co-write. We wrote this song because we know everybody's been coming out of a tough couple of years. We wanted to do something just a little bit different. So when you're having a tough time, just kind of think about this. You know that we'll get through. We've had tough times before and we'll have tough times again. 
will get through it. Some days are gonna be dark. Some days you're gonna feel blue. Some days you don't know why. No light is shining through. Life ain't easy, but just keep holding on. Cause better days are gonna come along. And I hope your hope wins. Storms in. Find a way to let your joy back in. I hope your hurt fades and peace reigns. The promise of your mended heart remains. When it feels like you can't get back up again, I hope your hope wins. Some days the mountain's too high, a little too steep to climb. Some days pushing through seems like a waste of time. There's gonna be struggle, there's gonna be pain, and days when we're just slogging through the rain. But I hope your hope wins, your storms end. Find a way to let your joy back in. I hope your hurt fades, peace reigns, the promise of your mended heart remains. When it feels like you can't get back up again I hope your hope wins and I hope your hope wins Storms end Find a way to let your joy back in I hope your hurt fades And peace reigns the promise of your mending heart remains When it feels like you can Get back up again. Feels like you can't get back up again. But it feels like you can't get back up again. I hope your hope wins. 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 Thank you all so much. That's Daryl Wallace on the WDVX Blue Plate Special. You can keep up with him at DarylWallaceMusic.com. I also know he brought a little bit of merch with him. You can go visit and say howdy over by the merch table at the end of the show. We're going to get switched over for our next act. While we do that, I'd like to tell you that support for the WDVX Blue Plate Special comes from the Corporation for Public Broadcasting, the Tennessee Arts Commission, Barley's Knoxville, Downtown Knoxville, and Visit Knoxville. We got a bunch of great live music coming up here soon. Um, I especially want to highlight uh, a show that I, another show that I host called Kid Stuff, which is kind of like a blue plate special for kids that we do on the second Saturday of every month, and it just so happens that next Saturday is the second Saturday. So. Our special guests will be Ewan's Jug Band, and um, they'll be a whole lot of fun. They've been on the show before, so you can come down, bring the kids down, and um, be in the audience just like this for a show especially for them. Um, also got a lot of great stuff coming up on the Blue Plate Special. Coming up on Monday, we've got the Honey Badgers. On Tuesday, we've got Tim Necht and the Jarrett Stout Band. Thir um, Wednesday, we've got Henry Luther and the Blackouts. On Thursday, Jack Summers along with Justin Caleb. And then Friday at the Big Place there in Barley's. At Barley's, we've got Tim Decker and Tennessee River. We'll be right back here next Saturday for the Acoustic Breakaways. So lots of great live music coming up on the calendar. You can always keep up with what's going on at WDVX.com for sure. Well, um, I'd like to give a big hand to our tech crew today, Jeter doing the camera work and Johnny in there doing the sound. Let's give them a big hand. And I got the thumbs up from Johnny. How about from the folks on the stage? We about ready up there too? All right. Well, I'd like to give a big welcome to Tom Utes 
and Eric Brace. What you get for getting older is a little less time. But the miles mean so much more now as you move on down the line. You're losing the desire to look back over your shoulder. That's what you get for getting older. Deeper the color, richer the flavor. Sipping it slow, cause it's meant to be savored. It's not about the high, it's not about the blues, it's that feeling you get when it's going down smooth. What you get for getting older is a little less time, but the miles mean so much more now as you move on down the line. You're losing the desire to look back over your shoulder. That's what you get for getting older. very much and thanks to WBBX for having us and thanks to Red and Tony and of course Sean here. It's really great to be here. When we look over our shoulder here we see a lot of beautiful blue plates with so many of these artists that we know and love. What do, how many more times do we have to come here before we get our own plate, huh? It's I think they stopped doing the plates. Oh, no more room for plates. When did you yeah, stop we, doing we have it? boxes full of them, apparently. Okay. So, yeah, so not enough room for even the ones that we have. This is, uh, this is one of our first shows since our new album came out. Um, Tom and I have a new record out called Simple Motion, and it's on my, my label, Red Beat Records, B-E-E-T Records, um, and it's out there in the streaming world, so you can... Uh, you can find it there if you want also. This uh, next song is Red Beat. This next song is called Frost on the South Side and it's all about the changing seasons and it's all about uh, a man who was once a, uh, he once worked uh, in the fields in Canada but then they invented the combine harvester and he was out of a job and so uh, I keep thinking that one of these days we're gonna be out of jobs with AI and chat GBT, GPT and uh, holograms on stage at the Blue Plate Special, but for now it's just us and our guitars and songs. One, two, three. <laughs> OK. 
Came in with the threshing crew on a train from east to west. We did the job and moved along without a day of rest. But now we've hit the Rockies and all the wheat is in. My thoughts are moving north to south, following the wind. When the frost is on the south side, that's all you Nights are getting longer and soon the winter snow. When the frost is on the south side and clouds are hanging low, chilly winds are telling me it's coming time to go. I've seen the red winged blackbird and the meadow lark in flight. In the skies above Alberta, sad and lovely sight. Can't blame a bird for going heading south on feathered wing. I'll follow where they lead me and listen when they sing. When the frost is on the south side, that's all you need to know. Nights are getting longer and soon the winter snow. When the frost is on the south side and clouds are hanging low, chilly winds are telling me it's coming time to go. That's Tom Utes and Eric Brace on the WDVX Blue, DVX Blue Plate Special. Y'all, welcome to the show, or welcome back to the show. Well, thank you. You have played on the show before, but this is the first time I've hosted you, and I've enjoyed getting to know a bit about your, your history together. Um, you, you just released an album called Simple Motion, which is your debut duo album. It that's is. That's right, that's right. But, 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 yeah, go ahead. I was going to say, saying that doesn't give them a sense of how long y'all have played together and collaborated. So tell us that story a little bit. Well, we've been, to, we've been playing together for about 10 years. Eric was in a duo with a fellow called Peter Cooper, and uh, then we got to know each other, and they sort of reeled me in, and we made a couple of records as a, as a trio and started touring together. And then uh, so, uh, about two years ago, our friend Peter Cooper passed away at the age of uh, 52, and we decided that we wanted to keep... Uh, recording and performing, and so uh, in, in May last year we were in England on the road and had some ideas that we were tossing around, some song ideas, and came back to Nashville and decided to make this record, Simple Motion, and we did this uh, last summer in my studio. We did half of it as a duo, singing and playing like we did today, live in, the, in one room without any overdubs, and the rest was <clears throat> with a band with the great Mark Fain from East Tennessee on bass, with Lynn Williams on drums, 
Tammy Rogers of the Steel Drivers on fiddle and the great Mike Compton on mandolin and the Steel Drivers banjo player Richard Bailey was playing on it and our friend Justin Moses. So it's been a lot of fun just hanging out and playing with these fine folks. I bet every single one of them has played on this stage. Oh, all of them, many times, yeah. many times. Yeah, it's quite a, quite a crew that you assembled for, for the we, record. We, we, you haul in the best when you live in Nashville. Yeah, you know? well, that, that, that sounds wonderful. Um, so both of you do some other things musically. I know, um, Tom, you have a studio and Eric, you um, have a record label. So tell us a little bit about those things. Well, um, yes, I do have a studio in my house. It's, uh, I call it my adult playground. It's, uh, it's a good size <laughs> studio. It's not like one of the big ones in, stu in Nashville, but it's, it's, uh, it's big enough to make good records there with the band. Um, and I always have an, an open door there for people who I like and uh, for the people that I work with, like, like Eric. And I made a record there with Tammy Rogers and with Tim Stafford of the, uh, the great band Blue Highway. And, so it's, it's nice to have that, you know, it's my creative space. I write there, I record there, and it's a, it's a great privilege to have something like that. And also to have one of my best friends have a record label. So we are sort of a self-contained <laughs> unit because we make them and he puts them out. It's old school, you know, like two days later, it's on the radio. There it is. Tom and I both moved to Nashville from separate places um, about 20 years ago. Tom moved there from uh, from the Black Forest of Germany, where he had been uh, raised by wolves. That's true. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> little known fact. Uh -huh. And uh, I moved down there from Washington D.C., where I have uh, I had started a band called Last Train Home that's still ongoing. And uh, my wife and I started a label called Red Beat Records in East Nashville back then. And um, we put out a whole bunch of records uh, over the years and. Uh, check it out, redbeatrecords.com. And um, but we did not put out one of my favorite records of the last 20 years, which is one that Tom made with Peter Cooper in a collaboration with the great Mac Wiseman, who some of you probably know about. Yeah, we're going to play you a song of that. It's the title song of the record. The record was called "I Sang the Song." Mac was one of the uh, the founding fathers of bluegrass music. He played with Bill Monroe and with Flat and Scruggs, and then had an illustrious career as a solo artist and, and Peter and I got to know him and made a record with him and he told us all these incredible stories about growing up during the Great Depression in southwestern Virginia and we approached him one day and said, Mac, can we turn these songs, uh, these stories into songs with you? And he said, boys, I, I would love that. So we, we went over to his house for 11 Sunday afternoons in a row and wrote these songs and uh, Mac was 90 years old at the time so he had a hard time getting in and out of his studio so we asked a bunch of bluegrass people to come in and sing these songs, people that had been profoundly influenced by Mac. And uh, one of those people was the great John Prine, who had been great friends with Mac. They both had an affinity for keeping the Christmas decoration up year round. And I think that's a special bond between people when you do that. We don't do that, Eric and I. No. But Might anyway, start. regardless, uh, this, is the, this is sort of the conclusion of the album. It's, um, it's all... It's comprised of lines that, that Mac told us, and Peter and I wrote this song. And as I just, uh, Mac Wiseman passed away about seven years ago, and uh, uh, the great John Prine passed away at the beginning of the pandemic in April in 2020, and Peter passed away in 2022. So of the four people that, that had something to do with bringing this song to life, I'm the only one left, which makes me a little uncomfortable, but I have... Uh, I have, I have made a vow that I was going to play this song uh, at every show that I play from here on out to honor my, uh, my three friends, uh, John Prine and the great Mag Wiseman and especially our, our brother Peter Cooper. So here's this song. It's called, I Sang the Song. I could hear the highway call long before the road ran through. Dreams are free and not much else is. What else can a poor boy do? Calais, France, and the cliffs of Dover. Name a city I've been there. Women laugh. the same most anywhere I was baptized in the old South River 
Three times forward I've been blessed Just another young hillbilly Who could have known This is another one from our uh, from our record that we just put out. Um, I don't know what I was doing, but the phone rang and it was Eric. And I said, "Man, I'm in this gas station and there's this woman on the phone, and she just yelled in the phone, are you on your way to Arkansas?'" And I thought, "That sounds like a song. What do you think?" And I was like, "Yeah, probably does." And you hear these phrases and you you start making up these stories in your head. You can't help it. And Arkansas is a beautiful word, isn't it? It's so singable. So we, uh, we started writing that, and, he, and an hour later, he sent me two verses, and I thought, oh, that's great, and I started writing a nice kind of boom chuck a boom chuck a jaunty tune, and I showed it to him, to, and Tom said, no, slow it down, it's different. And when you slow it down, everything kind of stretches out, and everything gets a little bit darker and weirder. So this is, this is the dark, weird song on the album. <laughs> Are you on your way to Arkansas, to the gambler waiting there? Don't say I didn't warn you, don't say that I didn't care. Are you on your way to Arkansas, smoke rising from the track? If you cross that Mississippi, don't you think about coming back? Damn that mighty river and that bridge from Memphis town. You're still chasing him, chasing him down. Fooled you with his money, he fooled you with his grin. 
I'm the fool who's left behind, but it might not always win. I know you're on your way to Arkansas, but did you hear he's back in jail? Me, I'd leave him there to die, but I bet you're posting bail. And that bridge from Memphis town They ran him out of Tennessee But you're still chasing, chasing him down Well, thank you very much. We're glad you like it. And uh, I, and for those of you out there in uh, in Radio Land and Streaming Land and Facebook Land, come come and find us. Come and find us uh, out, out in Nashville sometime. We'll be uh, touring Europe in May, and um, you can find us at uh, Eric Brace and Tom Mutes on Facebook and uh, Red Beat Records. Yeah, and please go ahead and, and feel free to to stream the album too. We um, will. Well, thank you. I'm glad you like it. I love it. Even better. Even better. <laughs> this is a song that uh, I guess you could call, uh, call a uh, pandemic song. It was written in um, middle of 2020, and we were all in locked up. Yeah, we were in lockdown, and on my street, there were a lot of uh, youngsters who were really frustrated being locked down and uh, a lot of creative kids, uh, musicians and dancers, and some of the parents got the city to close off the street that I live on in East Nashville, and we had a block party, a socially distanced block party, and we all brought out our lawn chairs, and all the kids came out and on, in their lawns uh, at a distance and played music and danced around, and it was just great. And there was one, one youngster up the block who... Um, had been learning how to play trumpet that spring, and I used to hear him practicing, and he came out and sang and played his song. But uh, to me, that, uh, that trumpet was always the sound of hope. So uh, it's called Just a Moment. Better days, ways away. Sun is up and down again. Don't ask me the hour. I couldn't give an answer. I've been gone and I came back. The neighborhood is looking different. There's a distance, it's so much more, more than we could ever measure. And oh, when I wake up in the morning, there's a moment, just a moment, when 
when everything is light. Then, oh, I open up my eyes and I remember everything has changed. There's a boy up the block practicing trumpet on his porch. What does he know? He's just a kid. But he sounds so good playing. These are a few of my favorite things. Oh boy. Shut down the news and turn away. Listen hard for something good. Something fine and unelectric. That's Tom Utes and Eric Brace on the WDVX Blue Play Special. I'm hoping we can get one more song. Sure, um, sure, but before sure. that, let me um, say a couple of thank yous. Thank you to everybody out there who is watching or listening, everybody who came into the studio today. Also, let's have another big hand for our first act, Daryl Wallace. Yeah. Yeah. And Tom, I, w I was going to just skip over this, but um, I've been watching you play. And you just remind me too much um, of one of our um, favorite, mutually favorite guitar players. Your, your clean, tasteful um, picking reminds me of some of Norman Blake. And I know you have a special uh, connection to him. Yes. Well, uh, yes, um, I, I love Norman Blake's music and so does Eric. But uh, I had the really strange idea at the age of 50 to start uh, to, to pursue a, a master's degree. And I wrote my thesis on the sense of place expressed in the songs of Norman Blake. And you have just told me that your first date with your wife was going to a Norman Blake That's right. concert, and <laughs> she was the one who initiated that, so I congratulate you on your <laughs> On finding her, her, yes, yeah. <laughs> she has very good musical taste, for yeah, sure. <laughs> you're not a bad guy, so that's she has good, good, good tasting guy. I think too. it worked out all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, let's get one more song before we have to get out of here. Worked out for Blake at the end of the day, you know, and that all admit, that's all I admit. <laughs> right. This is the uh, final song of the album, uh, and it came about where I, I read a poem. I, I subscribed to some of those poem of a day, poem of the day emails, and uh, the Poetry Foundation 
sends out different emails every day, and there was one that came came over the transom called Sea Fever by a fellow named John Maysfield, who I'd never heard of, but this poem was published in 1916. He had been a sailor, among many other things. Uh, he'd been a sea, sea fellow, and um, he ended up becoming a, the poet laureate of, uh, of Great Britain for decades, actually, and I was kind of ashamed I hadn't heard of him. But when I, when I started reading this poem, it had a rhythm to it, and the rhythm suggested the music, and I couldn't help myself. I, I did a co-write with a long dead poet. I, I put his poem to music, and I invented a chorus. I hope he'll forgive me from beyond the grave. Nothing um, you can do about it now. Nothing. It's called Sea Fever. I must go down to the sea again To the lonely sea and sky And all I ask is a tall ship And a star to steer her by And the wheels kick and the wind song When the white sail's shaking And a gray mist on the sea face And a gray dawn breaking I must go down to the sea again For the call of the running tide Is a wild call and a clear call That may not be denied And all I ask is a windy day With the white clouds flying With the sea and wind blowing And the seagulls crying to the sea, I must go down to the sea, I must go down, I must go down to the sea again and sail the whole world round. I must go down to the sea again, that vagrant gypsy life. To the gull's way and the whale's way Where the wind is a wetted knife And all I ask is a merry yarn From a laughing fellow rover And a quiet sleep and a sweet dream When the long trick is over To the sea I must go down to the sea I must go down I must go down to the sea again and sail the whole world around and all I ask is a merry yarn from a laughing fellow rover and a quiet sleep and a sweet dream when the long trick is over Thank you very much. Thank you. That's Tom Ute and Eric Brace live right here in downtown Knoxville. We hope you'll join us next time for more real live music on the WDVX Blue Plate Special. But right now, I'm going to send it back into the studio.